This heat wave can be devastating, including for our family pets. Well, today, Gina Esposito went with animal control officers in Charlotte, and they learned about a dog left in a car. She was there for the moments that followed. CMPD animal control officer Keisha Martin let us ride with her today as she took calls about dogs being left out in the heat. Her first call, this dog that was being kept in a hot car in East Charlotte. Hi, how are you? I'm concerned. About my dog? Yes. It was around 88 degrees then. We didn't even think that it was problem, you know. The dog's owner says she had been staying with family who wouldn't allow the dog inside, but she eventually agreed to tie the dog to a tree in the backyard so it would have shade. I'm going to give her some information on free rabies shots. I'm going to try to cover all bases with her. She's trying to do the right thing. But just as we were about to leave, the dog broke loose from the tree. And I was bitten. Never been bit by any animal. It's been 15 years. But just after talking to the owner, here it is. I was bitten. Oh, I can see even some of the bruising right here. Right. What was supposed to be a routine call ended with Martin having to seize the dog. That's not the outcome I was looking for, but that's where we're at. Despite what happened, Martin wants to stress the importance of why she showed up there in the first place. Check this out. Since May 17th, our team of meteorologists say temperatures have been in the high 80s and 90s. That's reflected in the number of calls CMPD's animal control has received for pets. From May 17th to May 30th, they've had 90 animal cruelty calls, including 36 for dogs being left in hot cars, at grocery store parking lots, even movie theaters. Remaining calls were for animals being outside without food, water or shelter. Martin's job is to find the best solution. Now Martin's is even taking your dog out for a walk in this heat can be damaging, especially if it's on concrete. Using her heat gun showing that the temperature here 116 degrees, which can be really harmful to your dog's paws. Back to you. Well, the dog in Gina's story is on a 10 day quarantine at animal care and control while they investigate. The best thing to remember about the heat is dogs have around the same body temperature as humans, so if you are uncomfortable, then your pet is too.